afternoon people um this is now our it's our christmas wild camp um the josh nearly never came on because josh was a little bit poorly yesterday weren't you josh mm. he had the sniffles he had the sniffles um he had his flu jab at school that squirted up his nostril um so he was a bit rough weren't you josh he's okay look at the camera look at his hair I can't log his hair, it needs a cut, but um, he's not willing to have it cut. But today, where are we, Josh? Kirkfell. Kirkfell. We have been here before. Yep. So why have you come back? The camera is in front of you. I don't know, because you wanted to come back. What happened last time we were at Kirkfell? We lost the GoPro. We lost the GoPro. Stop looking at the floor. Uh, we lost the GoPro. Uh, it's like the case of Wasdale, really, because we've been, we went to Kirkfell. We lost the GoPro. We went to Pillar. What happened to Pillar? We broke the camera. Broke the camera. What else? Yeah. Punctured your tyre. Punctured your tyre. So it's like three things. Oh, Josh spilt his hot chocolate it's all not, over the tent. It was pretty extreme. It was a whole thing of hot chocolate and we had nothing to dry it up with. So it was a bit of a nightmare. Um, so that's why we've come back really. As you can hear, can you see her? Dory has come again and she is knackered more so because she has the inability to sort of come up the mountain at a normal speed like me and Josh who are already shattered because Kirkfell is so so steep isn't it really? Yep. It's only like two point something miles, two point something kilometres so it says it's a normal walk it would take 32 minutes but it goes up straight away you can see it behind me actually how steep the grade it is it just goes up and up and up but if you look i'll show you now um it's been misty all the way and if you look over wasdale or was water you can actually see it's like a vote what's the word enveloped i don't know it's covered what enveloped oh enveloped I don't know. in mist it's like an inversion so it goes all the way around, so you can see scarf bells. I don't know if you can see, at the top of them you can actually see a tiny bit of snow. But um, yeah, look at that. Now that is a view to be greeted by. I can hear someone shouting. I don't know what that is. So I don't know what to do. Could they be in danger? Okay. Should we go and save them? Might be a bird. Has anyone watched that 14 Peaks programme? If you have, compare, what's his name? Nibs. Okay. Nibs, also the main character. He has a moustache, and it's a very nice curly moustache. And if you look at Josh closely, you can see now, he is sporting a moustache. It's not November anymore, is it? Dory, Nappies, <laughs> me, sweaty, but I mean, look at that. That is pure, pure nice viewage, isn't it, Josh? It is. It'd be nice when we get at the top. It will be. Okay. Well, we're going to get up to the top and set up the tent and we'll come back to you then. Speak to you later, guys. Yep, goodbye. Goodbye. Evening folks, um, we got up, it was much, much tougher. Yep. I think it was, was it pillar tough? Yeah. I think it's, it's just, it's, I think I'm getting old. I think that's the main thing. I'm, I feel like I'm really getting old. Um, but you say that was tough. It was tough. I think it's the, the incline is just so steep. It goes up so still. I think we, I felt like I was on a breakdown and we were panicking because we wanted to get up and we to see the sunset. I mean, you'll see the sunset now. And the inversion all over um, was water. I mean, it's crazy, really, isn't it? It's very nice, very nice, very beautiful. I think Dory, I don't know what Dory is, so this she is. She's now tired and she's ready for food. So we're going to go and get some water in a bit because there's like a little creek over there. Um, it's a bit cold. 
Do you think it's cold? Yeah. It's getting colder. I think it's meant to go down to, um, what's it meant to go down? It's not that cold at Six night. Sixes and sevens. Sixes and sevens, but, but I feel like it's a little bit colder to be yeah. fair. Um, I'm starving. Are you starving? Just tired. And what time is it now? Half three. Ten to four. Ten to four, so we're going to be tent bound for so long. But if you can see that sunset now, I'm, I'm probably my head and Josh's head are in the way. Um, that makes it worthwhile because you don't get views like this really, do you? No, you don't, do you, Josh? You don't get views like this. It's just, and it's so quiet because um, it's winter time, isn't it? So you, you don't have everyone coming down. So the, water, the actual drive, which I hate coming into uh, Wasdale, because it's such a narrow road and there's so many cars um, that come down from the opposite way. It was so easy, wasn't it? We flew. I think it took us like two hours, 40 odd minutes, which isn't bad. We haven't seen any person climbing up the mountain at all. Have we? Oh yeah, yeah. <laughs> what did I get on this one? We were driving to Wasdale and um, I, I needed a piddle basically. I was desperate for the toilet and I know there's like a little pull-in, there's like a little drive, like a car park really, where you can you can park up and it's, it's, it's a regular piddling, piddling spot for me because you can just run into like the forest. And I was like driving up and there was someone out the car. I was like, oh, no way, I can't get out the car. And me and Josh both looked at each other. I said, it's Andy Beavers. And it was, it was Andy Beavers on his phone. We were like starstruck. I was like thinking, shall I go back? I think, oh, he's on his phone. I could have asked for Andy Beavers' autograph. That, that was the highlight of the day, that. So Andy Beavers is somewhere around this way. I have no idea where he is, but we will look forward to seeing his video. So has he got anything else to say? He got a snotty nose. He got a little snotty nose. Um, he got Murdoch as well. Oh, he got Murdoch. Josh has got a lizard. We couldn't bring it with us because it's too no, cold. Too cold. Um, in fact, I'll get Josh to put up a little pizzard, a little pizzard of the lizard um, that he's got for Christmas. So his name is Murdoch after. It's a gorilla's reference from dodgy band that Damien Orban was in. But here, put a picture up, up here. Don't you, Josh? Yep. Of Murdoch. Yeah, yeah. Um, Dory gets a bit jealous, though, don't you, Dory? A little she jealous. Likes, she likes a little jealous. But anyway, we're going to go and get some water and get some food yep. and settle down in the tent because the sun is going down. Watch the sunset. And hopefully, well, it's, it's such a peaceful night. No, no winds. We're meant to have no winds, but I'm, I'm pretty sure it's like five or ten miles an hour. Yeah. But it's not the bad. On the website, it's five, today. five miles an hour. So we're going to have a nice sleep. It's going to be. I think it's dropping. It drop a bit colder. But um, you can see the ice on the top of Scarfell. 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 Yeah, there's been some snow on here. Isn't snow it? on Red Pike. There was a little bit of snow on here before the Dory started to like, and Josh walks around in his hand. But we're going to go up now, and um, we'll speak to you soon. Well, we'll speak to you tomorrow, unless we think of something in the tent. Anyway, speak to you later. Take care.
Morning folks, um, last night was pretty much uneventful, really, mm. Mm. Um, there were stars out but the moon you would have seen, um, we had a full moon so I think that was making, picking out the stars pretty difficult, um, it was nice though, it was, the tent was nice, it was, on, it was a slanty pitch. It was. it was a slanty pitch, so Josh was like rolled up into the corner, and I think he was snoring. Either him or Dory was snoring, was Dory. very loud, but he's got a cold, and Dory stunk as well, because I think just before he went to bed, she went missing, and Josh says she was rolling in the grass, but I've got a feeling that she was rolling in sheep shit. Um, Dory, stay away. She's going to knock the camera over, I'm paranoid about it falling over. Come here, come here. Do not think she looks like Father Christmas. Father Christmas from the planet of the apes. Um, but as usual, every time we come to uh, Wasdale, it's something always happens. So we obviously we've got the inversion. You can still see it's still there from yesterday. That's on uh, Waswater. <clears throat> the sunset was beautiful. The sunrise. He's got a time lapse of year doing the sunrise, haven't you? Yeah. But um, it's not coming up. It's kind of coming up over there, over Great, Great Gable and the Scarfells. But um, it's nothing spectacular, really. Do you think? Mm. No. No, you're tired? A bit. A little bit tired. Uh, we've got to start making our way down now. Hopefully it's a lot more easy to get down than what it was to get up. I think it only takes about an hour getting down. It shouldn't take us too long. Why have you got your back to the camera? What, what, what do you think you're doing? Hey, speak to the camera. Go on, you turn. Speak. About what? Just, don't know. Speak about yeah. Murdoch. I don't know what to talk about. Speak. <laughs> <laughs> I'm only joking. All right. Mark's out of 10, Josh. Mark's out of 10 for this one. A seven. Why? I still think it was that good compared to last time we came. Really? Yeah. Why, what was better last time we came? There was the inversion surrounding us, wasn't there? Yeah, I suppose. But I, I still think this is an eight. An eight? Yeah, it's I think it's wonderful. an eight. I think the year seven's quite harsh, really. If we, get, we never got sunset last time. It was dead claggy. I think we got the cloud. Oh, you're a bit. You're cool. very harsh. Very harsh. Yeah, we didn't have Dory either. Dory wasn't with us. Dory's got to give it a, an extra one just for she for her being here covered in sheep poo. So I'm going to give it an eight. Okay. All right. Okay. Jo <laughs> Josh is as talkative as ever. So anyway, um, happy Christmas. Wish you all the best. Hopefully, yep. we'll be out soon, not in a major lockdown. Josh probably wants to be a lockdown because then we can't go wild camping. Yeah. Um, oh, it's exams, yes, you've got exams. We'll be going again during the two weeks holiday. Don't you fret, my son, don't you fret. Anyway, all the best for the new year. As usual, give us a like and subscribe and we will see you soon.